Carrie's all lounging. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah, we're uh relaxing today on this Memorial Day, right? No pool. Yeah, no, nah, it's too cold, right? Barbecuing. Just hanging out. So then of course today's Tuesday, which is really like the Monday week, you know, for me trying to get everything going on. So this is the last week that Bella has school. And it's been one crazy of a week. Um, so today or this week is Bella's last week of school. Tomorrow, however, she's done for the year. all lounging yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah we're uh relaxing today on this memorial day right no pool yeah no nah, it's too cold right barbecuing just hanging out hi mason <laughs> oh you're funny Yesterday was Memorial Day and I really didn't vlog too much. You guys saw a little bit um, because on Bella's channel, she wanted to vlog for the day. So I was like, okay, that's fine. So I vlogged for her channel and really didn't do too much on ours. Oh my God, but yesterday was such a, like, it was annoying. I'm going to say it's annoying because Bella one minute was fine. Next thing we know, she's not feeling well, but she just had a really bad tummy ache. Um... She has her teeth, her two front teeth are coming through. One popped through and the other one seems like it's struggling to pop through. And I think that's just what was like really bothering her besides her allergies. Her and me, and this is what was really annoying. Paul was smoking the ribs that he made yesterday and my eyes, like you can even tell like they're still, I like no makeup on besides mascara. Um, and my eyes like been bothering me ever since. I don't know what was going on. It was just crazy. And then her eyes were itchy and bothering her. They were all bloodshot red. I'm like, it's gotta be the smoke for both of us. So I think that's what took me and her both down. So, but yeah, but we enjoyed like, you know, just relaxing family time. We didn't have anybody over. It was just us and the kids. Um, so that was fine. So that was Monday. So then of course today's Tuesday, which is really like the Monday week, you know, for me trying to get everything going on. So this is the last week that Bella has school so it's not gonna be as bad or as crazy but it's still like I'm not doing what I'm supposed to do like this morning I woke up and I was up with Bella a couple times last night so I was so tired so I'd not get up when I wanted to get up to go ahead and go live on TikTok and do what I normally do with moms I was like you know what that's okay things happen and I'm not gonna stress out about it so after that like but I've been on a roll. Like, I dropped Bella off and I went for my walk because my goal is to walk three times a day, a power walk in the morning and at night, like morning with by myself or with Paul if he wants to come, at night with Paul, and then in the afternoon with like Riley and the kids. Um, and that's, you know, so far happening. But then I came home and I got a call from Bella's school 
that she doesn't have lunch. And I'm like, yes, she does. It's grilled cheese today. Like I wrote it down and I must have like clicked the wrong button when I was writing stuff down that she wanted. And I must have said no and said yes. So I have to go and drop a lunch off to her, which is fine because I had to go out anyways. I have to go get some stuff from the Girl Scout store. And I'm like, you know what? This is fine. I added her vlog really quickly because she doesn't need her lunch for another hour. So I'm going to quickly make her a little lunch and I'm gonna go to the store and then come back. And you know what? It's gonna be a good week. Like, I have a feeling productive-wise. You guys know I always say that, but I do. Like, I'm gonna like, we're gonna take things slow. We're not gonna stress out. We're gonna enjoy our summer. We are really gonna enjoy our summer. So this week's project that I wanna do, and like tomorrow, Bella has field day at school. So I'm gonna be gone majority of the day. And of course, it's like our crazy day anyways where I pick her up after school. So I literally, I wanna say like, I get home by one and then I have to leave two hours later. So there's really not gonna be a lot going on tomorrow. So I figure I'm gonna treat today like a Monday and do like emails and paperwork, which I already did some stuff already. Um, but then this week for our project, because Riley's home, Riley and Mason, we're gonna focus on organizing the living room toys. I'm gonna pull the couch apart. I'm gonna already probably start vacuuming today when I get back. Um, even though I do vacuuming and dusting on Wednesdays just underneath the couch just to kind of prep that and we're gonna try to organize everything My goal is to kind of like I really don't want to have the bluey toys down here I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with them. Mason just looked at me like what? No bluey toys down there, but no, I'm trying to figure like I just want to organize a little bit more so But we got to organize your room first so right now we'll leave the bluey toys down here but then we're also gonna clean up Mason's room this week. So that's my goal. It's just Mason's room and down here because Riley's, um, Mason's closet, the stuff that's in his closet is Riley's stuff. That's So that's what she's gonna be working on. And then next week when Bella's home, I wanna give her a week off of school because then we're, I'm gonna teach her for the summer. And so I wanna give her a week off, but starting next week, maybe not Monday, but for sure Tuesday, I wanna organize her room. So I wanna, um, go through the bookshelf and we got new um, American Girl containers that Gianna used to have that now obviously she doesn't need anymore and I want to put all the new stuff that we got for my generation and like the big doll stuff like in her container so everything's all nice and organized for her so that's what I want to do and it's not going to be that long so we're just going to take things slow we are going to do it's warm outside but it's not at first when I was walking I was like oh there's a little bit of breeze but then when I was done it was getting really warm so I was like you know what I'm going to do my 10 minute breaks outside later on after lunch. I am trying to get some color in my face. I do have SPF on, but I still like to go outside and still kind of get some color in my face. Not too worried about, you know, like going outside and tanning. No, just 10 minute wake, just to soak up some sun. So, but yeah, but that's the plan so far. So I always like to tell you guys like what's going on and what's been going on. So, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what we're gonna do this week. Office too, I'm really trying to clean out the office and put all the overstock of like taping for Bella Bean's channel in the laundry room and also still getting that stuff in the laundry room into the garage. So hopefully between this week and next week, that's what's gonna be happening. So not too much because like I said, I really wanna go ahead and prep for the summer. I want the kids to enjoy their summer. I've got kind of a schedule that I want um, them to be working on. So, but I'm gonna make Bella's lunch. I'm gonna go bring it to her. I'm gonna go to the store and then come back. All right, so this is the project that I'm gonna be working on right now. So we have um, these toys over here, okay? And Paul and I were actually talking about taking the coffee table and the couch and kind of moving it this way, and I think I'm gonna try it. So Mason's gonna haul me right now, but we are going to... Um, Oh, I feel like I'm gonna go through all this stuff first. So I'm, cause I told him like, I wanna start, we were, the reason why I never opened that stuff was because um, we were going to be painting in here and I just thought it would be easier and that never happened. So I'm like, you know what, I'm just gonna organize their kitchen. So we are going to go through Bluey cause I have Bluey stuff up there. I'm not really a fan of it up there. So my goal is to get everything gone and I'm thinking this carpet, I don't know if it would make sense to go this way now because I kind of want to not have the coffee table on 
the carpet. It's kind of heavy. So I'm just going to slowly, and obviously like this thing's not going to stay here. This is just here temporarily. It's going to go downstairs in the basement when we do the basement. But for right now, it's just there and it has all the video game stuff in there. So, which is fine. We don't have anything over there. I'm okay with that. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to vacuum out in the open. And I think I'm going to take all the bluey stuff and just temporarily put them up here because we're going to organize and make sure we're not missing anything. So that's what I'm going to be working on with Riley and Mason. All right, so this is what we were working on pretty much all day yesterday. So I got my little buddy over here. Hey, buddy. Yeah. You're building tracks. Well, let me see if I can put this light on because it is like... I can't see you. There we go. Are you having fun building tracks? Yeah. So he's building tracks and doing, um, watching some YouTube. But um, this stuff is going to go by. Um, Mason, don't forget that you have some cars up there. It looks like, oh my gosh, who is here? It is <gasps> Ramon and Sarge. Ramon and Sarge. That's crazy. He so landed. he's grounded? No, she landed. She grounded. He's what? She landed. And here. Grounded? No, she landed. Landed. Yeah. Okay, we don't jump on the couch. But anyway, so I took off all the bluey stuff up there. Yeah. Sorry for the light. And I put all of it here for now. I'm just leaving it right here because I need to find my storage system from the garage. Um, so it's just going to temporarily be right there, but I told Paul, Paul doesn't know if he likes this. Let me see if I can back up just a little bit. Okay. So he does not know if he likes this. What do you guys think? I think his concern was like having the carpet be, or the rug, the couch being on top of the rug, which I can understand that. But then I was also thinking I'm going to back up. I'm really sorry for the light. Um, but I was thinking to solve that problem. What do you guys think? If I take the rug and move it over slightly, it's not going to be center with a fireplace, but it's going to be like center with the coffee table and the entertainment center. But like I said, this is not going to stay here. So I don't know. So that's one thing. And actually the couch might go just a little bit more. That way I can't go further because of the, the, um, kitchen but what do you guys think about this so i'm gonna take the kitchen and all the toys that are over there and the bluey and i'm gonna put it against this wall paul's like he doesn't know if he likes that he said to me that that just I don't know. He doesn't think it'll look right. I think I might do it just for a little bit just to test it out. One, he does not like all the cords here, which I completely understand. Like, I can actually unplug that. We really don't need that anymore. But this stuff over here, I might just move it over so you really don't see the cords. Um, obviously, he's not done with this room and needs to do the trim. They are around the windows, which, you know, hopefully he will be doing soon. But my deal was obviously if you have the kitchen back here, it's they're going to play here. It's not going to be bad. So we might have a little bit more room when I move this up just a little bit more. Um, and then all the LOLs that are down here and the bluey stuff will be in containers over here. And I just feel like it would look neater. Like I feel like it being over there it doesn't, but I feel like over here it does. But we will be getting a new couch. We've had this for eight years, maybe. Um, maybe even longer than that. I thought, I thought eight years, but I'm not sure. But um, it's been long enough. It's at least eight years, if not ten. At least eight, eight if not ten. But I don't know. So um, yeah, I kind of had to do a standstill on our project, and I'll actually tell you why. All right, so stand still on my project this week so you guys know that the project of the week was trying to i mean i did get the living room cleaned up i did clean everything up vacuumed everything 
Um, the only thing I didn't do was like vacuum like the couch or wash the floors because I do that the first Wednesday of the month and that's next week. So I'm gonna do that next week, but it's all prepped, so that's really good. Um, but my other thing, what I was gonna do was do Mason's room and I did not get to do that. So it's Thursday already and it's been one crazy of a week. Um, so today or this week as Bella's last week of school, tomorrow, however, she's done for the year. Um, Bella had to come home today from school. I don't know what's going on with her. So she came home on Tuesday from school. I don't even remember if I told you guys because it's been like that crazy. So she came home Tuesday from school. The nurse said she had 102 fever, but she's, and then one, then it said 101. So it was bouncing back and forth. She's like, you know what? I might, things not working the right way, but she is warm, but she doesn't feel that warm to me. I was like, okay. So brought her home. She didn't have anything going on on Tuesday. So she rested, took her temperature, the highest I had was exactly 100.0. And I'm like, this is really weird because the nurse is telling me something different. So, um, kept her home yesterday for field day. However, she was fine. She was acting normal. I was like, maybe she just doesn't want to do field day, which is fine because it was like four hours of being outside. And you know, I showed her pictures and she's like, mom, I really don't care. So she stayed home. So it was fine all night. Went to dance yesterday. Went to bed this morning, woke up, was fine, went to school. I get a phone call for the nurse again. I'm like, what is going on? And I it, I literally just plugged my phone in and went outside to go um, uh, do whatever outside. Oh, I was taking Barclay out and left a message that she has 103 fever. I'm like, what is going on? So I called, they said I have to pick her up, which is fine. Um, But I was just like, this is crazy and she feels fine. She's just very, very tired. But what's sad is they have the rule that if you have a fever, you can't be back in school for 24 hours. And I'm like, that's really sad. So she's missing her last day of school. She got everything. I'm like, it's just, you know, she said bye to her teacher today. So, you know, she was fine, but she's wasn't as warm when I brought her home. I told her to go take a nap. She's been sleeping. Um, but then I just felt her and she's a little bit warm. But when I took her temperature, she was 100 again. So I was like, okay, what is going on? So she's just resting. So my, I've been running around back and forth and it's just been like, I have to, um, couldn't do what I wanted to do today. So was working all day, um, went live a lot on um, TikTok. I was actually, and it wasn't even like just unnecessary lives. I actually went live to blow dry and straighten my hair. So basically what I would do in the bathroom, I just went on live and was talking to people. So I was on there for like, I think I was taking my hair like a little, like 15 more minutes to do my hair. And then I also did my nails today. So I did these last week, but I did these um, today. I filled them before Bella was supposed to go to school and I was all set ready to go with that. And I just painted them. So I was showing them, I went live again to show another, um, product on there. So I mean, it was like I was on there, but I wasn't, it was just like another extra 15 minutes. So realistically, it was like an extra half hour on live of like doing something that it really was like, you know, whatever. So, but I did that and it's just been like crazy all day. I feel like I haven't been getting too much done, but you know what, then like I had to go pick her up and then I was, you know, hang out with her. And then I went live for an hour with the moms like I normally do. And it's actually like, I didn't even realize it was 4.30. I was like, this is really, really crazy on how like I'm trying to organize everything and clean up so I don't know if I'm gonna finish Mason's room this week but his room isn't that bad that I might just go ahead and tackle it right now um for a little bit and then you know figure out what I'm gonna do or I might just do it in the morning I haven't really decided but um it's like you know when the kids get sick they come first so I put everything at home but you know what? we got the whole entire summer I wanted to go outside and do my 10 minute um 10 minute you know, R and R tanning, whatever you want to call it, soaking some sun, but didn't have not done that yet. Did go for my walk this morning. So I'm like really good with my walks in the morning. I have not done my walks after lunch because then obviously like I had to pick up Bella and then it, that was really crazy. Um, hopefully tonight I'll be able to go for a walk with Paul because uh, he likes to do it in the evening. More cart. They can't see you because of this. Yeah, I got to take the back of my chain. 
Sure. Here, I can pick you up. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Ooh. Hi. There you go. So this is my only one that feels okay. Riley's not really feeling well either. So, and they've got a lot of stuff going on because they have dance auditions and clinics and all that next week. And it's like, ah, uh, bad timing. Mm. Bad timing. So, um, he's just been, I think we're going to go upstairs in your room and we're going to, um, go through your stuff. Cause we're still on, <laughs> I got you. We're still on the hunt for the tile buses he's got. He's missing three out of the four and we're missing the Sally, but it's not really a big deal with Sally. It's just, um, because we, I got her, got him another one, but, um, yeah. So I think we're going to go ahead and do that. I'm thinking we're going to work on your closet first. Yeah. Cause I'm wondering if that's the only place I haven't looked in and I was wondering if it's in there. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's June Thomas and Dinosaur etc. You're silly. Okay, tell the vlog you'll see them later. Hopefully. See Hopefully I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, <laughs> see I'm so you later. <laughs> ah! All right, here she is. So she's been lounging pretty much all day. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm trying to get a good picture of you. There we go. Um, ah, there we go. Ah, you're dark again. It's very, uh, you know, Berkeley jumping. Berkeley, knock it off. I, uh, I don't like when my kids don't feel so good. So, but rest is the best. Haha, <laughs> I rhymed. So how does it feel that you're done with school? Because you can't go to school tomorrow. So you're no longer a first grader. You're a second grader. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. It's like beyond crazy to me. So, all right. So we're going to rest for the night. All of us. We're going to hang out. Can I eat? You can. Your brother and sister already ate. So since I'm ending the vlog, you want to say bye to everybody? Yeah. So say... Thank you so much for watching, guys. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, Bye. We'll see you in our next vlog. Bye. Bye, guys.